Good evening, good afternoon, and good morning. I have a cup of coffee with some cinnamon and cream on top. Mm. So delicious. Anyway, the build we're running is a fairly simple build. We've got a four sword here. We have a purg staff here. Now, I, do I have a better one? Because this one's kind of, you know, it's whatever. No, I don't. I really got to roll a new perk staff eventually, but far too much work. Far too much work. Anyway, here's the talents. We've got all this. We got going brain burst with. Uh, actually, you know, I'm going to get rid of that and grab something else. Um, uh, damn, well, nothing else really to grab. Let me just grab. Oh, I can grab one of these. Perfect. Store up to six warp charges. Anyway, didn't know this. We have kinetic flare, uh, wildfire, uh, one with the warp, psychonetics aura. We got we're using the bubble shield. Not really wanting to use the venting shriek. It's all increased damage to based on peril. It's all of this, and then warp siphon for the warp charges for our cooldown. That's the build. It's pretty simple, uh, and that's enough yapping for me. Let's get into the video, shall we? Alrighty, and we're in. So I got my uh, my YouTube pin number so I can actually, you know, get the money that I've earned. Although they said they only pay out between the 21st and the 26th. And it's currently the 28th, 27th when I got it. Uh, so I missed the, the payment date, unfortunately. So I'll have to wait till next month for that. Or, well, December, after, the day after Christmas. Or, well, it could also be the day a couple days before. So that's good. Nice. So, uh, I had something to say. I had like a whole topic I wanted to talk about. Nope, I've got none. Uh, well, I don't have nothing. It's just I can't remember what I was gonna, what my original topic was. But my secondary topic is, I was gonna talk a little bit about myself in terms of my uh, personality type. I'd like to say I think I'm like the equivalent, the human equivalent of a frog on a log. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm just chilling. You know. Uh, I'm not a very, like, wanting person, necessarily. Uh, in the sense of, like, oh, I, you know, my life's not complete without this, this, that, the other, or something, you know? Uh, I'm very easy to be contempt, very ha like, very happy individual overall, I'd say. You know? Uh, oh, once I clear my throat. Sorry about that. Ooh. 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 Uh, I'm a very contempt person, or contempt? Content, not contempt. Content person, very chill. I think at one point in my life, I just rejected stress. I don't know, I don't get stressed very easily or if at all. And if I do get stressed, it's not like... I'm tripping over it, it's just like, oh, well, I have to deal with that. That's something I have to deal with. You know, like, stress doesn't affect me very much. And I think it's because, like, I've always had this kind of... I haven't had always had it, but when I was a kid, this, uh... I had a nanny, and, uh, my, I was... We were visiting my nanny's house, and was, Uh... Where am I? Oh. Oh, one sec. Ooh. 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 Alright. Uh, I heard him, like, I was talking to him, or someone was talking to him, and he said, you know, well, he was talking about something, he's like, you know, that, 
problem. I'll cross that bridge when I comes when I come to it. And ever since I was like, I want to say I was eight at this point, it's kind of like stuck with me. Where I'm very much like, oh, you know, if something comes up, I'll deal with it when I deal with it. Or it's, I'm not like putting it off. It's just time. no point really rushing it and like stressing out about it. Just deal with it. Deal with it. But like another example is that like some people are like, oh man, I wish I, you know, I did something productive with my day instead of playing like video games or scrolling my phone. I'm like, yeah, there's maybe better things to do than scrolling on your phone or like for five hours. But at the same time, like that time was gonna pass anyway. And if it made you, if you were having fun at the time, as long as no one was getting hurt or you weren't putting something important off, like going to the doctor, it's whatever. It's also like kind of like why I think I'm fine with taking a long time to do things, because like the time's gonna pass anyway. Uh, might as well get it done. Now I, I say that, but I'm not like like that with everything. There's some things where I'm like, oh, that's gonna take me far too long, and I just I'm not that invested into it. But if I was invested into like a project like a Warlord Titan, you know, the length that that would take would not phase me, because that time is gonna pass anyway. Might as well do it, doing something I love, which is miniature painting. <coughs> That pox burst reminded that just saved me. Oh, damage with peril actually makes the brain burst do something. <coughs> nice. You know, when I was ranking my the brain burst in the video, I was just I was ranking the grenades. Purely off of just straight neutral, like not considering like builds or anything. The only excuse with that was like the uh, the knives, which I ranked very low. Some people seem to disagree with me on that, which makes sense. Uh, but I was, you know, obviously they were talking about like, oh, well, if you do it this way, it's like a pocket revolvers with infinite ammo or something, which is like, which is true. And I even said the knives are good, but they're like they're very niche, and that's why I had to rank them low in terms of. Uh, you know, positioning. Anyway, back to what I was saying. You know, it is I like very much like it is what it is, or I'll deal with it when I when I when I have to, kind of vibe. <clears throat> and it's not like me procrastinating issues. It's just like I'll probably be better equipped to deal with it when I need to deal with it. When it's actually like, you know. Excuse me. Oh. Some here. Shock troop. Ah. It's just normal damnation, by the way, not arc. I've <coughs> I just kind of wanted a quick one. That sounds like high praise. Oh. Alright, nice. Uh, yeah, it's just... Now, that mindset, is it, like, maybe not the most optimal? Absolutely. But I'm not, like, a very much... I'm not trying to min-max life here, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm very much, you know, content where I am. And there are some things I'd like to change. Like, I'd like to be in a house that I own instead of rent, but... You know, it is what it is. I have to be a little realistic here when it comes to owning a house. It's, you know, pretty much impossible. Now, there's still things that, like, kind of eat at me a little bit, like... Like, my credit card situation's a little eating at me a bit, but... I'm at the same time, I'm like... It's hard... I, I don't waste energy stressing on it because I'm, I'm dealing with it. It's just, you know, the time it takes to deal with it is a bit longer than I would have originally liked. That, you know, I can't, you know, medical expenses are going to medical expense. What am I going to do about it? <coughs> oh, Jesus. Like, if I was better at brushing my teeth, the problem would have been solved. But when I was a little kid, you know, I don't know if it was depression or some, something else. I wouldn't say depression, but like, 
the big shad TM uh, or something else, but I was terrible at brushing my teeth. I didn't want to do it. Maybe it was like my own little form of rebellion as a kid. You know, like, ah, now I'm a kid. I'll stick it to the adults but not brushing them. Here's adult me wishing that if I could go back and, you know, brush my damn teeth. Oh, I'm so tired. Ah, ouch. Where was I? Yeah, just, you know, I do remember, like, like, some people seem to think that I'm, like, a lot of people seem to think that I'm too happy in a way where I'm, like, they're, like, wondering my secret or whatever. Like, I remember I had a friend who was in a very bad mental health crisis. Uh, and not to get too in deep into it, but they were, they were, they were, it was, it was pretty bad. I remember them one time they were crying and they asked me, how am I, like, how am I happy? Like, how do I feel happy? Uh, and it was just like, you know, I just, my best advice for kind of not gaining happiness, because I don't think anyone could, like, replicate another person's mindset to, like, feel better. The best way is like, just like, you know, live with, you know, don't think too far ahead. It's like my biggest thing. It's like the farthest I've thought ahead is like a month. I very much live in the now. And I don't mean like, oh, I live in the now, so I'm going to do wacky, crazy things. It's like I find joy in the now. I think about the now. I don't think about, you know, what's happening next week too much, unless I have like an appointment. It's like, oh, I remember to have that appointment next week or whatever. But I'm not worried about like, oh, what am I gonna do next week for this, that, the other? It's just you know, I'm, what is, what am I doing today? What am I doing today that's so that I gotta do? You know what I'm saying? <coughs> the problems will come, no matter what you do. No one can prevent all problems, so deal with them as they arise, and you'll feel a lot better about it. Well, that's also another thing. I don't like push off problems, right? If a problem shows up, I, I try to deal with it to the best of my ability. Uh, in that moment that it appears. And if I can't, I'll figure it out the next day or whatever. Figure it out when I can figure it out. I think that's very... I don't know how I developed this mindset. Maybe it's because when I was grounded for eight years, maybe I entered Nirvana. Which is a possibility. I'm like kind of a wise guru. Gotta remember that if I explode my head, I'm done. The shield doesn't clear of my peril. But it would be good to drop the shield anyway if I explode, just so my allies have a bit of a safer time going to uh, save me. Like, I think if I ever did mushrooms and had an ego death, I feel like I'd be... I'd actually just become a monk at that point, I feel like. Like, uh, I think another thing is, like, I know what I like, so I know what makes me happy. I'm not, like, searching for new... I'm not, I'm, like, I'm kind of a boring person, you know? I don't, I don't really feel the need to go out clubbing or go out, like, to big events. Like, I'd like to go out and play Warhammer games, but unfortunately, the Warhammer shop near me, nearest me, is two hours long. Or two hours long, two-hour drive. As much as I love Warhammer, you know... Ooh. There's a scab trapper coming for me. Ah, oh, there was two. <coughs> this is unfortunate. There was two, and my blade unfortunately did not reach. I'm trying to ping the sniper behind him. 
I'm probably gonna perish, but you know what? It's my fault for not being down there helping this guy. Can I really not ping that sniper over there? There it is. Yeah. My bad. But you know, I will say one thing. Uh, I, I do complain about small town American jobs a lot. Uh, I think jobs are like the biggest thing that stresses me out, just trying to find one. Uh, and I think it's just because it's annoying because, you know, you'll see a bunch of like 20 million job applications open and it's like, are these real ones or are these just out here so they convince their shareholders that they're hiring or that they're bringing in new employees or whatever? Well, what's the worst crime that small town America, uh, at least in Cal California, well, small town America in general, but like, there's probably some states that don't have to deal with this too much. But, uh, the area I live, which is, like, there's pretty much no, like, family, re like, chain restaurant. No, like, mom and pop restaurant, if that makes sense. It's all pretty corporate stuff. Except for, like, one Chinese place near me. Uh, and that one's pretty good. Uh, but, you know, all the food here is, like, Firehouse Subs, you know, McDonald's, Burger King, Los Alanzales. Which is a chain restaurant of Mexican food, which I did not know for the longest time. Uh, and then, like, uh, <clears throat> what else? Um, a wiener schnitzel, which actually I like wiener schnitzel. I like it. It's very, it's like if you want something light, and, but you don't want like a salad or something, go to wiener schnitzel. They also have really good milkshakes that are like cereal flavored. Oh, they're so good. A Fruit Loops milkshake can, will, like, will change a man. Ooh. All right, nice. Obliged. Yeah. <coughs> yeah, there's no place here that it can walk into and be like. Hey boss, give me a chicken palm out of there. You know what I'm saying? And then he'd wrap it up and, you know, on a hero sub, you know, extra saucy to the point where it's like, it's almost impossible for the bag it's in to support its weight. Like, if I, I can't, there's no place I can go in and get a sandwich that I have to activate muscles in my back to carry. You know what I'm saying? Like, I love food. I have a mean food, I have a loving relationship. Um,. For the most part. There's some foods I'm, I don't vibe with. Like, I'm not a soup person. But I love me some sandwiches. Uh, and I like... I like both light and heavy. But if I had to choose between, like, light sandwiches or heavy sandwiches, I think I gotta go heavy. Like, I love a chicken parm. I love a Philly cheese steak. I love a spicy chicken sub. Ooh. But I do also like lighter sandwiches, you know. Like a like a like a, there's a sourdough chi like sourdough grilled chicken that's pretty good. It's very light. It's just grilled chicken, sourdough, some tomato, avocado, a little bit of bacon. The bacon's optional, and then like cheese. I usually get a pepper jack because I'm a big pepper jack fan. And that's what I get. <clears throat> anyway, that was a short video because uh, it is almost 2 a.m. Because I just recorded some Lethal Company, so I was just trying to get a dark tight video out. Uh, but if you made it this far in the video, and also my voice is absolutely wrecked, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, like and subscribe, or don't. I am not your mother, but you better brush your teeth. Now have a good one. Bye-bye.